Hi everyone, it's Brenda. I want to come on and do a card share with you. Um, I have made, oh well, they're all the same style, they're just in different colors. I did assembly line style, which I love to do when I'm making mask cards to try to fill my card box so I could just kind of grab them when I need them because I'm kind of bad to wait until the last minute. So I want to make sure I have a little on hand to start. Um, especially since I just had my Rolodex challenge and I want to make sure I can get cards out to everybody for their birthday. So I want to have some on hand just in case some come up that I don't know about um, or I'm not quite ready for because um, life gets in the way and you don't have time to craft whenever you want to, uh, unfortunately. Um, if you are interested in sending Rolodex, I was thinking I'm going to take them all year round. Um, so this way, every now and then, I'll pull from them and send some happy mail not only just for birthday cards because um, I am doing a major clean out in my craft room so if you want to be part of that you can email me but you have to email me or private message me on YouTube or Instagram wherever you follow me for my mailing address I'm not going to contact you for it that's the one stipulation besides being a subscriber I would uh, ask for you for this and I'll just do it you know whenever I'm cleaning out I'll pick a name out of there and send a little something as I'm cleaning up my um, craft room and de-stashing things I don't use, which I have realized is quite a bit. <laughs> okay, to get on with my cards, um, you can also, if you need more information, you can uh, email me. It's um, I'll put it in the description box below, but it is on my About page on YouTube. Um, I have made blue. I made four cards of blue, four of yellow. Four blue, four yellow, four pink, and a total of six purple because I actually pulled an extra sheet out so I figured instead of putting it away I might as well just use it anyway. Um, and I just cut a three inch by two inch piece and a two and a half by one and a half and two by one. And this is all in inches. And just stuck them down onto cardstock and this is a regular A2 size card and took some ribbon and just ran it from the top to the bottom and tied a little bow and put it on top so it's like a stack of presents. Now I have left the insides blank so this way I could just write on a sticky note or something the message and stick it in here because this would be cute for a congratulations, a baby shower even and you put like a little um, you know pacifier or another die cut on it says you know congratulations or you know little girl little boy whatever or if it's happy birthday you could put a uh, happy birthday if you'd like to but I want to leave them so they're kind of have a different couple different purposes and then I'm gonna put my stamp on the back um, but I did want to show you that I have gotten these done so far and I'll probably just leave them like this until I'm gonna send them and I did them in pink and it's the same measurements like I said for it so it's perfect for scraps if you have them laying around and just you know stack them up and this would probably be a really cute idea too for like a cake because then you'll have the tears. Just an idea. <laughs> and then the yellow and blue. And I used more of the pastel colors because it is still spring, so I wanted to have some of those started and on hand ready to go. But I hope you like them. And I'm hoping to get some more made, but I gotta allot some more time. <laughs> Yeah, thanks for our stopping by, and I've noticed I got some more subscribers, so thank you guys so much. And I must be doing something decent for y'all to come back. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I will talk to y'all in the next one. Bye.